y'all a little sneak peek of what, uh, what I got going on today. Uh, a little bit later, I'm gonna go get faded up. You know, I'm looking kind of raggedy in the first video. Uh, you know, all this here. This is all brand new. You know, 37 years old is, is, is what I got so far. Uh, so we're gonna link up with uh, JY. Uh, he probably one of the hardest barbers on the north side of Houston. Uh, yeah, we're gonna get footage of that. Uh, oh yeah, let me show y'all what I'm, what I'm working on today. Oh uh, shit, today, I've been working on this one for probably about uh, a good eight, nine months, but uh, man, we got a 68 Cadillac Coupe DeVille convertible. I mean, she is Jim. She is Jim. I'm working on this for my boy Orlando. Orlando wanted a reli uh, reliable drivetrain, and, uh, and he, and that's exactly what he got. He went and got himself a... Uh, 28, uh, uh, 5.3 out of a 2018. Let's see. What is it? Cam, BOD Delete, uh, Stall. Uh, this motor came on the crate. Actually, it came on that crate right there. Um, he was like, man, if you could stick this in my car. He was like, man, that'd be cool. Uh, no other shop wanted to touch it because it's 68. You know, these have uh, the cross the front. Uh, K member runs up front as you can see here usually on most old school cars they run across here so in this case the steering linkage is in the back so they didn't make motor mounts they don't make transmission mounts they don't make anything to do swaps on these cars so I made everything myself um, today I'm actually gonna be working on the cross member the transmission cross member uh, I got it up on, uh, in there fitted uh, but I needed a, a, a inch higher on the uh, transmission mount uh, location so I'm going to weld in this one inch piece here. I'm going to slide out here and I'll show y'all everything. You know, I don't know if it's going to be a time lapse or anything, but, uh, but yeah, I'm gonna cut the little slide out and weld this, get that fit up. After that, that's fit up. Uh, we need to weld him up a header. I'm probably going to need to order some, um, some inch and three quarter uh, 304 stainless tubing because I mean there is not much room in here as y'all see here the collector the the steering box right here it's so close to the engine it's like all four tubes have to meet into a collector right up in here and uh, yeah those, those are some hellacious bins I already got a uh, already got a header flange to start with um, but I'm not going to be able to use the piping that I thought I was going to be able to use. But that's cool though. We'll just get some and we'll make it. And y'all will see all that. But for today's project, we're going to get this uh, transmission cross number done and mount it up under the car. And then uh, hopefully I can get that done before I go to the barbershop. And uh, man, I'm going to catch back up with y'all then. Alright, next time. 